going on everyone, Juicebags here, and welcome back to some Dungeon Defenders 2. Today I wanted to take a look at the immensely overpowered new Storm Gloves that uh, have been introduced to the game as a set piece. You see, Gloves of Storm, upon attacking your gauntlet, spawn a lightning projectile that deals 136% of your hero damage stat as damage and bounces up to seven times. Now those numbers do uh, roll differently. And as you see, this is actually an apprentice set of gloves here that I'm using on my hunters just because that's what I got. Uh, anyway, I found a few different sets of these gloves and played around with it and it is absolutely insanely OP. It's been uh, mentioned by I am Isam and his Friday Night Fun Stream and I'm pretty confident it's gonna get addressed very quickly. In fact, the numbers I'm going to show you here today are not crap compared to what it's capable of putting out. And uh, there's actually rumor that with the Monk Betsy weapon, with that secondary attack, that you can actually get over 100 million DPS with it on the, the dummies, which obviously that's just insane. But anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and take a look at it. Now, um, I found on the Huntress, I can get the highest numbers using the Mauled Cleaver which is just a 4 per second uh, 10 projectile scatter shot. You see I do have storm damage on it. And uh, let's see what it's capable of. That of course drops from uh, Onslaught mode. Wave 15, wave 25 and whatnot. Anyway, I'm going to get real close to this dummy and point down in hopes that uh, we have a little easier time reading the DPS number. And let's see what we can get it up to. Now this is uh, without using Dragolich. I saw a 300 there. There's a 780,000. Couldn't see that one. 872,000. Um, having a hard time reading most of these numbers here. I'll have to go back and freeze the frames. There's a 935,000 that was readable. So obviously putting out massive amounts of DPS on the dummy anyway without Dragolich. Now when I pop Dragolich into the mix, we should see some numbers well over 2, maybe even 3 million. There was a 2.2 million, 2.4 million. Couldn't read that one. Couldn't read that one either. And we're back down to a million as Dragolich is worn off. Let's go ahead and pop them again. And we easily get over that 2 million DPS mark. There's a 2.4. I've actually seen as high as 3 million uh, with this exact weapon, just doing this exact thing. Now let's go ahead and let's get rid of those gloves and Dragolich. And we'll hop. Let's see, let's let's go to the the old gun witch next. Now uh, the gun witch I'm still working on, and I'm actually gonna do a hero spotlight on a starter build for the gun witch pretty quickly. And um, this is what I can get to on the gun witch. Now, same thing, I got uh, what 134% seven times. So uh, I've got some gloves with gun witch abilities on it this time, or passives on it. So that's a you know, obvious choice to pair those two together. Now let's see what we can get up to with the Gun Witch and this weapon. There was a 832,000, 763, 782, 757, and down to 600,000. There's a 1.2 million. Wow. Uh, just under a mil on that one. 740, 677, 966. See, we're bouncing between like the high 600,000s all the way up to. Uh, one and a quarter million, which is pretty obscene. Now when we pop Dragolich in the mix, let's see what we can get. Here's a 1.5, here's a 2 million. Uh, 1.5, 1 1.5 as well. And uh, as you see, pretty beastly. Now uh, this is more of a nerf alert than anything else. This error with these gloves is well known. It's all over the forums. Uh, several devs, and uh, like I mentioned, I am Isam. I've already mentioned it. So it, it's going to get fixed pretty quickly. But since it is so well known and it is advertised all over the place, I wanted to make sure all my viewers had a moment to play with it. Uh, if you got that Monk Betsy weapon, give that a shot. Uh, just the secondary ability. Don't go up melee in it. Absolutely ridiculous. Now let's go ahead and switch over to what his. You know, the gun winch, of course, is throwing a loop in things, but I really fell in love with DPS on the Apprentice again. Now, let me get those DPS gloves back on, or the gloves of the storm back on. There we go. 
and see what we can get up to here. Now, um, of course, I'm using uh, a halberd. They drop it all drop at same as the same uh, attack speed, and able to get it up. Uh, what seven hundred thousand, six hundred fifty thousand without Dragolich, and then popping Dragolich gets it up to one and a half million. There's another 1.5, 1.4, 1.3, and it starts dropping back down there. But pretty obscene DPS, and it's those gloves are more than half of that DPS that uh, is being put out right here. Actually, it's probably more like 75 or 80 percent of the amount of DPS it's putting out. And you see, after even after we stop attacking, we're still ripping off 300 thousands. There's an 80 thousand and uh, haven't attacked in several seconds. Now let's take a look at uh, some different weapons with the Apprentice, as I do like playing on the Apprentice, and I like using this weapon um, for the the damage resistance and the movement speed, or just, I'm a big fan. Anyway, let's take a look at, say, the Blaster Caster. Now we got an 8 per second Blaster Caster here. That's going to rip off a whole lot of these little lightning balls pretty darn quickly. Let's see what we can get it up to. See, we are at 780,000, 650, 670, 771. Putting out some nice numbers, and of course the Blaster Caster is not even remotely accurate, but cool as hell as being uh, one of the galactic weapons. We're able to put out some nice numbers. Let's take a look at it with uh, Dragolich up. There's a 1.5, 1.2, there's a 2.2 millions of DPS per second, which, uh, needless to say, is just absolutely incredible. Now let's take a look at even a different weapon here for the Apprentice. Let's say, what else do we have? Let's actually go with the Stormkeeper. Here's a 4 per second 5-shot Stormkeeper with water damage on it. And you'd actually be amazed at how effective this can be at just putting out massive amounts of DPS to an entire lane with that little spread. Now you don't get the uh, you know the movement speed of the halberd, but you do get nice DPS numbers over a, a large AoE area. But let's take a look at what it can do just on one target here. Let me let some of these zappies go away. Go away zappies! Alright, looks like they're headed out. And let's get back in here and get up on top of this dummy right here. Let's see, there's 200,000, 350. I couldn't see that one. There's a 640, 753, 759. Putting out some pretty ridiculous numbers here. And then, of course, when we pop Dragolich, we get well over 1 million. Well, there's a 1 1.6, 1 1.9. 1.1 and it starts to drop back down but uh absolutely insanely overpowered at the moment but at that same note immensely fun just to screw around with and watch the absolute devastation the um aoe on those little or the range on those little lightning projectiles is completely insane they will actually jump from mob to mob and go to other mobs that are halfway across the map just completely ridiculous now, one more thing I wanted to show off what we can get it up to when we throw the halberd back in the mix, but where we actually drop the scepters. Uh, you see my specter scepters, I've got up to six halberds that do 474% ability power, which is pretty decent. But let's check out the devastation when we drop it all. Now, uh, you know what, let me build it up first. I'm going to get the lightning built up first, and then I'll drop those those halberds there and pop Dragolich and see what kind of insanity numbers we can get here. Now, of course, these are nowhere near the um, the numbers that you'll get with that monk, that Betsy monk weapon. I actually played around with it a little bit, and it, <laughs> it, it did not want to run. I almost crashed my tavern. See, we're ripping off into 600,000 pretty uh, pretty regularly here and now. So let's go ahead and drop those halberds. Get 
get that ripping again. I actually lost most of the storm there with my my failure. See, there's a 1.8 million, 1.7 million. I actually didn't do it just, justice there with my poor halberd timing. Let me try that one more time once Dragolich comes up. Dragolich is good. See, there we go. We got all six of them going. I lost uh, the lightning effect, so letting that ramp up didn't do too much for it. But let's see what we can get here. There's a 1.8. I was hoping to see a number over 2 million, but I guess not. Pretty solid nonetheless, though, and like I said, a lot of fun to play with. And there is a little nerf alert, as uh, don't get too attached to your insanity DPS that you're putting out with these storm gloves, as it is going to go away pretty darn quickly. So anyway, that's going to do it for now. Thank you for watching. Click that like button. Please subscribe to the channel. And we'll be back soon with some more DD2. See ya.